gonna try filming again this weekend. I have already had my sh had my shake. No, I'm about to have my shake. <sighs> my brain is already not brain, and this might not be a good idea. I have already been up, published the mystery kit, worked out, and I hated every minute of it. Oh my gosh. I hate working out. I'll just say it. It's not my favorite. Maybe one day I'll come to like it a little more, but man, I'm so out of shape and it's just horrible the whole time. Today was a cardio workout. I hate cardio. I would rather just lift weights and be done, but I do know I need a little bit of movement. So... I did it. Um, I have a lot of work to do. I do want to try to maybe get finished up in the bathroom. Um, I haven't touched it since I talked to you guys last. Uh, that's a lie. I actually, um, I puttied in the doorway because it wasn't built up enough and I'm afraid that they'll bend over time and break and I don't want that to happen. That's what's happened in here. Um, because the, the floors were unlevel and over the years they've bent down and they're broke. And so, um, I'm trying to prevent that from happening, but I didn't build it up quite enough. And I've got to put more putty on it. So, I need, I probably need to do that right now so I'll have time to dry. Um, but I've only got a few more pieces. I've only got around the toilet, which I feel is like going to be a headache. And along the sink wall and then at the door i've already got all of the beadboard in my cart as well as the transition strip and i've been looking at trim for around the top of the beadboard i may have to like actually go in store and like actually look at stuff because looking online i just i don't want anything too big too thick and it all looks really big so maybe if i just go in store i'll find what i'm actually looking for but as of right now i don't know so I do have beadboard picked out and my transition strip for my, it goes in between the floor, the bedroom and the bathroom since it'll be two different floorings. So, I may get that ordered this weekend. I just kind of wanted to have the floor like pretty much done. Um, but I don't. And also we still have as much snow here as we did when I left you guys and it's been a week. It's been so cold, it's not melting. And then last night it um, sleeted on top of it. So everything's just a complete sheet of ice. So I don't wanna send Casey out in that to pick, just pick up beadboard, it's fine. So anyway, I'm gonna go in here and get to work. I have, I finished, we have a huge batch. Like we're working on about a hundred orders right now at one time. And, um, I finished printing all of Casey's stuff yesterday, so now I have to print all of my stuff, which is going to take me a minute because a lot of it is the pre-foiled stuff, and you guys have seen before, I have to run through two separate printers. So, I probably will be in the office the majority of the day just printing, which is very boring. I will film some of it, but it is very boring just to sit and print. So, hopefully... Maybe at least tomorrow I can get in the bathroom and um, film a little bit more in there. I, I hope by the end of this weekend I can have it done. We'll see. Um, I should set that as a goal. I've got three days. I could totally get it done in three days, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm sure at some point I'm going to get really sick of being in here printing. So, I'll take me a break and work on it. We'll see what happens. This looks so jacked up. Listen, we are not professionals and we MacGyver stuff a little bit, okay? Um, see, here's my issue. This right here, it's, it's not gonna lay flat. And so I need to build up a little bit right here so that we have a flat transition. That's gonna be our new um, flooring going into our bedroom. That's the same exact flooring that we have in the laundry room. So I think that'll look pretty nicely together. Everything's very 
gray. So um, the transition piece, like we'll have a piece that goes in between like that and then it'll transition to that floor. So I'm going to build this up a little bit right here and then that should be all I have to do. I feel like this is all pretty flat. So, um, you know, sometimes you just have to maneuver stuff to keep from doing the hard things, you know like completely putting down a new like subfloor or something. I don't know. I don't know what you would do in this situation, but this is what we're doing. So that's what I'm doing. In case you <laughs> didn't do this, I did it. So um, I still have just some little pieces there. And then around the toilet, I started using my rug and I want you to know my cat peed on it. She's never peed in the house like that. I don't even, I don't, I don't want to talk about it. I'm pretty mad at her, but, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do this, and then I'm going to get in the office and get to work. Guys, this is just plain old ice now. Like, there's no snow about it. It's just all frozen. It's just all frozen. It's hard to even walk in, ain't it, Parker? <laughs> Did I catch it on video? He just slid down the hill. I don't feel like I had it in frame. Come on, but I know. Look, he's having a hard time. Oh, we should just go in. This is not, we're getting all tangled in wires and shit. Oh, God. I'm, I'm over the snow now. done so this is my stack of just like regular foil it's all completely printed um I still have all of the pre-foiled stuff to do and I didn't expect to get it all done today at all so I think I'm gonna stop here for now I'm gonna make dinner I'm gonna make a uh, bacon and egg sandwich nothing fancy I love me some breakfast for dinner but I don't like eating breakfast at like breakfast time I love breakfast foods but not at breakfast time so bacon and egg it is and then i've just got a lot of computer work to do i'm getting a little overwhelmed thinking about all the things i have to do all right guys i had dinner i'm not gonna lie i've been scrolling tiktok for like an hour um i it's almost it's like 10 minutes until my cutoff time for fasting i'm about to drink one of these it's got 42 grams of protein i looked at these to um buy them on amazon I ain't doing it. It was 
was like 62 bucks for 12 of them. I mean, they are kind of expensive, but apparently, I don't know if they have them in Walmart. I don't know. It's so weird whenever I order from Walmart, um, it'll tell me stuff they don't have stuff in there at all. And then you go in and they do. Like, it's not even online as an option. What was it I had? Cilantro? I think the last time I ordered, th there was no choice for cilantro. So I had Casey go in and he said there was all kinds of cilantro. So I don't understand. These are not on the Walmart site for me personally. So um, I can get them at Kroger. But we've been grocery shopping at Walmart lately. So I don't know. Anyway, I'm not paying that much. I really thought I would just solve my issue and buy them on Amazon, but I'm not doing it. I could switch my Red Bulls for these, but that's not even, because I pay like 50 bucks for 24 Red Bulls. That's still, that's so much. They're good, but they're not that good. They're pretty delicious, but um, I've only, I had a shake for breakfast and then I had that um, sandwich for dinner. And I think this will push me up to almost 100 grams of protein. So that's why I'm drinking it. But um, I was saying earlier that I just have a lot of computer work to do. Um, I don't think next week I'm going to have releases. I feel like I done said that. But I need to prepare for um, all of the February um, exclusives like that is coming up soon I can't I've, we're already almost done with January stupid but I got all of the pixie palette done last night and I think I've got two pre-fold kits and then I've also got two new collabs coming up one right after the other so like I just have all of this that um I'm thinking about that I have to do and I full disclosure Mystery Kit went live today. I haven't even designed it. <laughs> I haven't even designed it. I did that with the um, the Black Friday one too. I designed it while I was in Pigeon Forge, like the Thanksgiving weekend. I had not even designed it, so. <laughs> I'll get it done and it'll be fabulous. And those of you that bought it will be glad that you did. But I think what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go try my best to get those last few pieces done in the bathroom. I feel like I'm really like on a roll with it. Like I know what I'm doing now and making my little templates. It's going pretty quickly. I really want to be done with the bathroom floor this weekend. I really do. Um, and then get all of the stuff ordered and then maybe, I don't know, maybe through the week next week or next weekend our project will be the beadboard and we'll be able to move all this junk out of my kitchen I'm so sick of having all this stuff in my kitchen so and the bathroom will be pretty much done I just need to figure out like the shelving situation but I'm not going to worry about it too much right now I'm going to move on to my bedroom and I'm going to put floors down in my bedroom and move along in there because I'm sick of my bedroom too so I'm going to go in here after I drink this and get those pieces done. I don't know if I'll be able to get the doorway done because that's still drying, but it's, it could be dry enough to just go ahead and do it. I don't know. These are pretty good. I forgot to show you guys the kind of flooring that we have. So this is Traffic Master um, Carrera Marble. I got it from Home Depot. I had to order it because we don't have a Home Depot, but it's 12 by 24 inch tiles. So they're really big. They're that big, but I cut them into four inch sections to get them like this. Um, and for this little bathroom, I ordered four boxes. I'm gonna say that there's only like 10 pieces per box. I 
got this stuff to put around the toilet. I feel like I've left too big of a gap right here. If this don't cover it, it'll probably be okay. Because I'm probably going to grout it right there and it won't be as noticeable. But I think this will work. I'm thinking about putting this here on the tub too and even down like the side of my tub. I don't know. It looks really good. It looks like a nice finished look. So I'll have to order more if I do decide to do that. But like I don't, also don't know how well it's going to stick. It doesn't seem too incredibly sticky. So I don't know. But I got this on Amazon. You guys, I started an Amazon storefront thing. And I do plan on sitting down at some point and like linking a bunch of stuff. I've already got like... A bunch of planner stuff linked to it but I plan on linking just like stuff I use and like all of the house stuff that I've ordered from there so if you guys want to pick any of that up I'll have everything linked for you I get so much crap on Amazon anything I can get on Amazon I do it's usually cheaper that way okay I dread this I don't know why. They just seem like stupid cuts. Mm. And I'm gonna have to knock back the um, concrete. I didn't do that part. I'll have to go find my, I thought it was in here. utensils for that tools whatever okay a little chisel chisel and hammer action you know how many times I actually hammered my finger the other day <laughs> I'm such a professional I move this over a little whoa you guys I know this wall looks awful but it's gonna be fine okay it's all gonna be covered up and you'll never know we have to turn this vent this way um, because the vanity covers half of it, but we've got like all of that to fix that. And put an electrical outlet in. I feel like this is gonna be the worst wall, but it's gonna be fine. I promise. It's already looking so much different. <laughs> This is uneven right here, but you know what? I wonder if I can knock that back. I don't even care because I could put putty there, I guess. That's going to be under the vanity, so I don't really care. Out of sight, out of mind, you know? Honestly, all of this is going to be pretty much out of sight, so I shouldn't care too much, but that one for sure. huge chunk. Whoops. Cut the weird shaped ones. Okay. 
Moment of truth. That's the best way to do it. Just make a little template. I even bought one of those nifty little things that you put around the edges and it makes the contour. I can't even, my brain does not work for those cuts most of the time. I did do it on that pop one. I don't know, my brain just does not, it, my brain does not brain when it comes to this stuff. I have to make dumb paper templates, but whatever works, right? There we go. I will say, um, I don't have the most straight cuts on some of these and that's where things started getting a little wonky on me here and there and not fitting properly but I actually have already grouted this little corner over here and when you put the grout in it kind of it really disguises it I, it would probably depend on the color of grout you get but I've got like a lighter gray and my weird cuts are not really bothering me as bad when it's art when it's grouted so That's something to keep in mind. It doesn't really have to be actually perfection. I think it would be hard to get every single piece to be cut perfectly. Um, I didn't do it. Okay. This isn't going to be as bad as I thought it was going to be, but it is going to take me... If I could get this done in an hour, that would be great. We shall see. Guys, it's done. I got that one little piece right there. I think I'm gonna wait though. I'm thinking that the beadboard is gonna come out to here and cover it. Plus the vanity's gonna be there. I think if I just uh, put God, grout in there, that that will be fine. But behind the toilet is done. All that's done. The only thing I haven't finished is here. I did get this piece down, but realized I've got to build up right here more. And then this little piece here, I guess that's it. I was thinking there was a piece there, but I'll put it in. This little piece here, I'm thinking maybe the transition piece will cover it. So I'm gonna hold off on it, but the whole floor is down. That's grouted. Um, I'm going to wait to grout tomorrow evening. Probably right before I go to bed. That way nobody's walking on it overnight and it has time to dry. But it's 2 a.m. And so I, I'm going to bed. I'm going to clean up my mess and I'm going to sweep. And I'm going to hit the hay because my back hurts. And I'm just... I'm more out. He's ready to go too. <laughs> so I'm printing all day today. Um, I set it up where I've got this printer here. I can just go from one to the other, which is what I have to do with pre-foiled. So, but the good thing about me having to actually sit and babysit these printers is I'm gonna get a lot of multitasking done. I'm going to edit and upload my vlog from last weekend. I'm probably gonna pull some stickers for my next plan with me, work on customs, design, 
So I pretty much will just be right here all day. Um, I do have to work out. It's 2.30, I haven't done that yet. <laughs> it's been a slow morning. I should really do some laundry. I'm hungry, I don't know what I'm gonna eat. We're to the point of we need groceries and there's still ice everywhere. Um, so there's that. And sometime this evening I'm gonna get in there and finish the floor. So I'm going to be grouting, which is really not that bad. It's way worse, I think, cutting and laying all of that down in there. So I think the grouting is gonna be easy peasy. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a pretty boring day as far as me being in here. Um, but I gotta get this done. I do really don't think I'll get it all done today. I really don't, but I'm gonna try to knock a bunch of it out for sure. <laughs> Because it wasn't you? He's a ruffian. Because it wasn't you? That's why you wouldn't. <laughs> have, you ever, have you done this stuff yet? Have you printed this with me? No, not what you have right now. It's just these two. Reprinted those monthlies. Did you find the other monthlies, or do I need to? I'm not done with the stack yet. Okay. They could be at the very bottom. They could be halfway up. They could be a quarter of the way. I know how you are. <laughs> I try to keep them all together. They were. Right. I mean, they were for the most part, yeah, except for those what two, these two, the 2024. If you let them. me look through them, if I'm not going to, I could to, go ahead and do it. Babe, yeah, I'll have to print. I just need these two. It's on the back, but that's what they are, is those two. They kept, they didn't cut back. They cut, that one's cut up too much, like uh, probably two steps, two little quick clicks. That's enough. Oop. Are you recording me? Yeah. Baby, I got my hood on and my light, look at this. He slept with that on all night. That's so bad. Oh my God. Don't. He's such a weirdo. I'm a weirdo. We're a bunch of can doers around here. Aren't we? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm we can. Yes, we can. Like Bob the Builder. We can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Oh my god, it's so good. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Yeah. 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 Sound like Ariana Grande. Yeah, did. Yeah. What? <laughs> Ariana Grande. 
I know who you're talking about, referring to, but I do not. I don't think I sound like a girl, do I? Do I sound like a girl? Mm -hmm. I don't look like a girl. Get her, bagels! Get her, bagels! Got her bagels! And he's like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. This thing's not pushed in all the way back here. That's pizza. <coughs> Get her bagels! <coughs> you push this thing in sideways, wow. Don't touch that. It's printer. back there. Look up, watch this. Do not touch that printer. I just touched it. I'm touching 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 it. Stop! I'm touching it. Oh my God. Let's touch it one more time. Hey, mm. can I tell you something? What? I love you. Mm. Babe. What? I love you. Mm -hmm. I do. Well, it's got a whole diagram and everything back here how you do that. I didn't do it like that. Babe. What? <laughs> um... Are you hungry? I am hungry. Are you hungry? I don't know. You ever call you a food fan? No. Okay, good. Do you want me to go to the dollar store and get you some stickers? No. Oh, do you want me to, um... Ah! Oh! You're so cute. I like your hair. It was really cute. Love the all black too. It's a very sexy. It's like a lingerie, but not. Yeah. Okay, cool. I'm done talking. We're talking to me. You can do it. Jesus, you have already recorded nonsense for 15 minutes. What? No, this is what I deal with every day of my life. You're so tough. You're such a tough person, Randy. You're not showing them all the stuff that I do outside. And ever when I used to work. Everywhere else. Because then I was a different person. Why is it dishes to me? Randy? Your liquid gold. For sure. I'll feel for you. Me too. Every day. When I wake up in the morning. To make sure you're there. What are you doing? Are you about to stop it? I was thinking about it, but then you just keep talking and I might miss something. You're not gonna miss it, you're gonna be here with me. <laughs> Are we gonna be together? Mm. Yeah? Mm. Okay. Thank you. Mm. These are reprints. Reprints? I'm a prince and you're a princess. You're a prince. No. That's what it sounded like. I have nothing on. Do you like that? I give you those danger hearts. Oh, why did he do that? He's just an idiot. Huh? <laughs> fully grown up, have you? <laughs> You're like a kid sitting there with a damn hood on. I don't have my tabby boots on. No <laughs> my ears are cold, babe. I don't have long hair like you. Yeah. No, it ain't gonna work. You don't say that when I'm wearing a toboggan. This is different. <laughs> this is different. This is the face thing. Mm -hmm. It's neoprene. Look, it even says it right It's there. like you've been playing ninjas and then you have to like sit down and do serious stuff. 
Ninjas don't <laughs> fly, Randy. <laughs> Shut up. I'm just letting you know, they're serious shit. Like all the parking lots, all the fields is a solid sheet of ice on top of all the things. They hadn't like cleared out the subway parking lot or anything? The subway parking lot looked like it was Christmas time. They had so many icicles. Like it was, uh, I swear to God, I thought they had Christmas lights on. I'm surprised they were even open. It's from one, it's just one person working it. I guarantee you, he had to walk. Cookies. That's a great for a diet, but whatever. Whatever. They had buy one, get one free. Footlongs on the app. Score. Oh my goodness. Bring me the frisbee and I'll throw it. Here to here. Bring it right here. Get the, oh, you're close. Bring it to me. To me. He just likes to keep away. Don't you? Bring me the frisbee. I'll throw it. That was Roxy's frisbee. Oh, oh. Can I have it? Can I have it? Let me have it. <laughs> no. I, I have to have it to throw it. Mr. Parker D. Barker. We have the baby gate up. Otherwise, he just comes in there and tries to jump on our laps and stuff. <gasps> you do too. You do too. Oh, get it. <sighs> we gotta work on that fetch thing. If you tear that up, I'm gonna be upset. Bring it here. You're, you're getting so close. You gotta put it in my hand though. Right here. Right here. Ugh. Come on. You come on. <laughs> Fine. I had to take a break from printing. I was getting very frustrated. Um, it's like 11 p.m. Um, I don't even have a full kit done yet. It just takes forever for those um, pre-foiled things. The pre-foiled kits, but I got to, I always save like the hardest pages for the last, the washi. And then the page that has the quotes on them, they just, if you don't have them almost perfect, your cut lines are going to go through them. So, 
I actually had to kind of redesign the washi a little bit and shrink one of the images because it just, I could not get it. I had a floor full of just pages that I wasted in there. So I got a little frustrated. It was starting to do better, but I just needed a break. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and grout. Um, I told Casey I don't feel like this should take me near as long. I've already grouted this one little corner over here and it's really not that hard of a job. It's actually pretty easy. So um, the cleanup is just what's crappy. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that done. And then I don't know. I don't know if I'll work on my laptop or just chill out and watch a movie. That's honestly really what I wanna do. So we'll see. I just, I'm so aggravated. <clears throat> I get so aggravated at that printing, but um, I got my vlog almost edited. That takes forever too, honestly. Editing these vlogs, it's a lot. So anyway, I was just thinking, it's 11 o'clock at night and it's telling you what I've done. It just seems like I've not really done a whole lot, but it's just very time consuming things. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get this done and then... We'll see how I feel after that. I've got to sweep first and run the vacuum, try to get everything out of the little crevices so nothing's like grouted in with the grout. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm so glad that this is gonna be a pretty much done project other than the doorway. Uh, it took way longer than I thought it was going to, but at least it'll be done. All right. I've already gotten around the toilet, so that wouldn't have been a very flattering angle of me trying to do that, but it's looking really good. I feel like it looks even better in person than it does on camera, but I'm going to set you guys up and film a little bit of me grouting. Uh, first of all, this is the grout I'm using. It's Fusion Pro. I got it at... Um, Home Depot too. It is in the color platinum. It's a really, really pretty light gray. I think it goes really good with the floor. I thought it would be darker than that, but I'm, I'm glad it's not. Um, I'm gonna run out. <laughs> I've only gotten that much left. Um, if I didn't have to fill in like gaps everywhere, I think it would have covered, but um, I've got more ordered. I just don't know that it'll get here because it's supposed to be here Monday, but I don't, we've not had mail all week. So I don't think the post office is delivering until the roads are safer so um we'll see how much of it I can get done with this but um this is the float I'm using and I actually don't know if this is the correct float you're supposed to use but it's working so um I got this from Lowe's and then I've got this bucket here and I've seen where you're supposed to like have two different buckets but honestly it's been fine. I've been going in with a towel afterwards and Lysol wipes <laughs> to um, get the film that it makes off of it. And then I'll get in here tomorrow and like mop and get it further um, gotten up. But it's coming together, you guys. It's very exciting. Like we're so close to being done. There's like glue places on the floor. The glue was very messy, I will say, but I feel like it was needed. I'm glad I used the glue.
looks so good. So I did run out of grout right here, if you can tell, just this one little strip, which, okay, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. No, could be cat hair galore in here. Are you kidding me? Ugh, these animals drive me nuts lately. Anyway, one little strip here, which works out pretty perfectly because I can't finish the door until we get that transition strip anyway. I'm gonna add a little bit of putty right there tonight and let that dry, but this is it, this one little strip. So I still don't completely have it done in this video. I don't know when my grout will be here, but for the most part, it's done. So I'm very happy with it, you guys. What do you think? It's very much trust the process because see how good even the little tiny pieces look now. I feel like a professional. <laughs> I love it. Good morning, beautiful people. I look like a train wreck. Um, I've been up for a little bit. I, ooh, my watch looks awful. It looks like I got glue and grout and everything on it. Um, I've been up for a little bit. That's what I'm saying. I've been up for a little bit and got some laundry going mopped in there but there's some spots that i'm gonna have to like really scrub because it still has like a, like a film on a few of the pieces and um so i'll get in there and do that sometime today i don't want it to set too long or I probably won't be able to get it up and played my silly little games on my phone and uh now i'm about to get to work it's just another printing day. I hope I can get more done than I did yesterday. This is, I'll show you my stack I got done yesterday. And this took me hours. That's it. Hours. It took me hours. Um, and you should see, see all that in the floor? I feel like that's not a good, it's, I'm on the sheet that's like the hardest, so. It did start printing better last night, so hopefully it's this. It's hard to get something like this completely centered. The washi's the worst one, so hopefully I can get past that pretty quickly and get a move on it because I really would like to get this printing done today. I don't know that it's going to happen, but hopefully it will. But that's it. Casey's cutting and I'm printing and that's going to be it. I've got to get this vlog uploading. I didn't even completely get it done editing. I've got to pull stickers for a plan with me still. Um, so I get all that done and I need to design. Same things I needed to do yesterday. I still need to do some of that today. So um, <clears throat> that's pretty much it. Another lovely day here at Planner Pixie Co. Notification. Um, should I film printing again? I don't even know. I guess. Um, for now, printing is going a lot smoother today. I've almost got through this first kit, um, which is sad, but um, I'm hoping I can at least get through the next kit. I really hope I can get it all done, honestly. I need to get the other kit done and all of the Pixie palettes. Um, and that would be great. I can start like actually foiling and stuff tomorrow or prep for it. Um, all of this needs to be out by the end of the week. <laughs> so, um, it's going to be a scramble to get it done, but we usually somehow get it done. Um, so fingers crossed I can get every bit of it printed today, but I don't know. I at least for sure want to get the next kit printed. Um, and hopefully it won't give me as hard of a time as this first one did, but, um, I think I'm just about to eat the other half of my Subway that I didn't eat yesterday. Um, I really need to order groceries, but everything's still so icy and I just don't want to send Casey out in my vehicle, which is what he would need to pick groceries up in. It's just... Our driveway's still a mess, so it's supposed to start getting warmer this week, but then also rain, so it's still going to be the crappiest weather, but hopefully that will melt everything and we can get back to business here and everything will open back up, but um, at this point, we're just kind of running out of food, but it's, I 
you know, I'm grateful that we have a four wheel drive vehicle that he can get in and out and get us stuff to eat. But yeah, and I still haven't worked out today. So I've got to do that as well. It's already 4 p.m. So I'm going to eat and then maybe let that settle for an hour and then I'm going to get my workout in and uh, just keep on printing just keep printing just keep printing um and then i've got my video finally um exported i'm about to start uploading that and so i'm gonna get into probably designing probably designing i'll wait for my sticker pulling this evening i guess i just keep looking worse and worse all right guys i finally got one kit done <laughs> one so now on to the next one I think I'm just gonna um start on the pixie palette which is really fun I hope you guys are enjoying the pixie palette let me show you it's pretty foiled well that's not part of it it's pretty foiled and it's just like little functionals you've got the squared boxes you've got pre-foiled date covers aren't those fun got little circles these would be really fun to pull in to monthly spreads this one goes well with the um i feel like you can't tell the headers very good um this color palette goes really good with the uh berry sweet kit let's see I know we had one laying here. I may have saved it for myself. Hold on. That also goes really good with this new February monthly. You could pull these in and give your monthly a little foil, but look at this. The new Berry Sweet Kit. It's perfect. It's perfect for this kit. So I love that. Also look at the new Pixie Pack. Super cute. So I think I might move on to the Pixie Palette just to do something different. And I feel like these were a bit easier. I don't know. It's pretty much just that washi sheet on the, um, kits they're just awful also did you guys see my new idea the layered underlays i get like a good stop shaking like a good look at that see how everybody's looking to layer their underlays now i mean it's not like foil on top of foil but i love it i think it's such a different neat idea there's that one reminds me of mcdonald's for some reason <laughs> i'm loving it look at that i love it okay i have been working on the pixie palette for february i don't know when this vlog will post because i'm also recording myself designing the mystery i don't need to post that too soon um the colors for February are St. Patrick's inspired. That's all St. Patrick inspired. So you probably will see them before I post this vlog. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, my days run together and I don't know what's going on half the time. But I'm off to print even more. Casey has called it a night. He's in there soaking in the tub. It's only 9 p.m., but he's tired. I turned the bed warmer on for him. I think he's probably just going to go ahead and go to bed, but I'm going to be up for another few hours and uh, I'm tired, but I have so much still to do, so. Mom.